After breakfast, Napoleon sent for pots of black and white paint. He then led the way down to the five-barred gate that went on to the main road. Then Snowball, for it was Snowball who was best at writing, painted out Manor Farm from the top bar of the gate. In its place, he painted the new name, Animal Farm. A ladder was then placed against the end wall of the big barn. Our new farm will now live by the seven commandments of animalism, which we pigs have studied closely, said Snowball. Every animal must obey these new laws. With some difficulty, Snowball climbed up the ladder and set to work. Squealer was a few rungs below him, holding the paint pot. He wrote in great white letters and then read the commandments aloud. The Seven Commandments 1. Whatever goes upon two legs is an enemy. 2. Whatever goes upon four legs or has wings is a friend. 3. No animal shall wear clothes. 4. No animal shall sleep in a bed. 5. No animal shall drink alcohol. 6. No animal shall kill any other animal. 7. All animals are equal. Now, comrades, cried Snowball, throwing down the paintbrush, to the hayfield. But at this moment, the three cows cried out. They needed milking. After a little thought, the pigs sent for buckets and milked the cows. Soon there were five buckets of frothing creamy milk. What is going to happen to all that milk? said someone. Jones used sometimes to mix some of it in our mash, said one of the hens. Never mind the milk, comrades, cried Napoleon, placing himself in front of the buckets. The harvest is more important. Comrade Snowball will lead the way. I shall follow in a few minutes. Forward, comrades. The hay is waiting. So the animals trooped down to the hayfield to begin the harvest. When they came back in the evening, the milk had disappeared.